Hello guys, it's mdragonblade 3 and welcome to another Minecraft video. Now then, I've got an interesting challenge for today's video. Today's challenge is Minecraft, but I have infinite levitation. So, this unate, well, this prevents me from being able to do a few things. Number one, touch the ground. And number two, walk. I can't walk. And stuff like that. Now then, this is hard, because once we go up a block, we can't go back down. Or can we? Because I have thought of something about this beforehand. Now then, this is only partially annoying, because I mine really slow. You know, I'm just going to give myself a bit of haste. Just to match the speed it would normally go. I think that's pretty much regular speed. Okay, now then, this is hard, because I've got to position myself in between the log and the leaf, so that I don't float up, but I still get all the logs. Now then, I didn't spawn under this tree, so obviously I had to go into creative and activate cheats to like put myself under this tree so that I didn't go straight up into the sky and also to give myself levitation because you can't really do that without it otherwise. Now then, there is a village over there. Now normally I would be the type of person to cheat and put myself next to a village but look at the coordinates. That's very close to zero zero isn't it? Now I think you can let me off on that one. Now, I think I'm going to place my crafting table here, actually, so I can actually pick it up. Now then, I, I don't know how we're going to be able to get stone. Well, actually, I've just got to... Here we go, guys. A boat. This is the cheat code. I have done this before, but I don't think I realised you could actually do this. Now then, what I'm going to do is place the boat there, and then look at this. We can move freely and go down blocks. The only downside is that, well, it's... The only downside is that it's really slow. Now then, that looks like a lot of mess over there, so I'm just going to stick to mining stone over here. Okay, let's place a block over here and over here just to make sure. And oh, we went outside of it. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Oh no, 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 no. Uh oh, 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 we're doomed. Oh no. Okay, okay. Right. Yeah, this is quite dangerous. I should probably do that next time. It still put me out of it. Oh, right. There we go. Sorry about that. Okay, let's try this again. Now we can freely mine stone. Let me... Oh, I do not want to get in the boat. Let me just put down my crafting table... I can make a stone pickaxe. I'm going to get all my stone tools. I don't know if every single one of them is going to be useful, however. Now, I am going to pick that up later. Just you wait and see. I'm going to get in the boat. I'm going to place the dirt there. Get under here. And then I'll be able to break all of this. Let's see, how much do we have? 13. Okay, we need three more, I think. Okay, there we go. Perfect. Just make my way back to the crafting table. Here we go. Sword axe. Put the pickaxe over there. Shovel, hoe, furnace. That's the order I always have it in at the start. Okay, hold on. Let me just get under here get the crafting table and turn the boat around and what I want to do now is get under that tree
But I also want this boat back. So I am going to place some dirt there. There we go. Then we just go under that. And break the boat and then... Oh, right. I need that back. Well, where, where does it go if I push it? Oh, are you kidding me? Okay, if we place that there, and then place that... There we go, nice. Okay, now, now we can do this. And then I'm pretty sure we can get under there, just in case I'm going to go in the boat. Now we make our way to the village. And I also found out a little while ago, by a little while I mean like a year ago, when I did another boat challenge, I forgot what it was. I think it was Minecraft, but I can't leave the boat? Or something like that? Actually, zero, 0 we're just about to come up to it. It is right here. It actually didn't put me at zero, 0 for some reason. It put me at like 32.16. I don't know why. Don't ask me why. But it did. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to deal with the fact that this is a very slow mode of transportation. Oh dear, we just went down a few blocks. Not a problem. The fact that I actually have haste makes me mine faster in the boat. Because you mine slower than usual in the boat as well as having levitation. So I guess that's quite cool, actually. Okay, right. Oh, I think I'm going to have to go up. Or, actually, I'm going to cut through like this. Yeah, there we go. And then we just go along here without falling off. And there is the village. It's in sight. Oh, actually, if we find a saddle in this village, then that means we can go and ride a horse. That is the key. That's the key to transportation. Horses. Because you can jump as well. Which makes it even better. Now then, unfortunately, this looks like it's kind of on a mountain. So this is going to be very hard to traverse. There's a chest room over there. So I'm going to try and go in there. I think I can pretty much just, yeah, do that. Oh, sorry, sorry. Don't close the door, me. Oh, emeralds. And food. Guess I'm living off apples and potatoes now. Okay, let me just go in here. Give myself a little break. Oh, I went quite more high up than I expected to. Oh, actually, a bit too high up. Yeah, good thing I have six planks. That means I can just make another boat and get out of here easily. I think two boats is great. Now that I think about it. Okay, I'm going to kill the sheep. Then I'm going to get under here, break this bed, get on that boat, which I cannot do for some reason. Why can't I get on this boat? Alright, you know what? Okay, let me just painfully turn around. And now let's decide how I get out of here. Okay, I think the strategy is we place this wall. Then we go onto this block, then I get out of that boat, go under here. Nice, nice, nice. Then we have a look around, I think. I brought the bed right here. I'm gonna sleep. I think I'm going to put my bed right about here. 
I'm actually going to... Oh, actually, I might get a few of these logs while I'm at it. Oh, yeah, there we go. A bit more wood to replenish our stocks. All right, let me do that. Then I can do that. And then I avoid all monsters. And the real question is, how do I get the bed back? Well, it's very, very simple. I just... Oh, wait a second. I'm going to be smart and break an entrance away for me to go down once I place the boat. Then I can get out. Oh, I've trapped a villager. Now, the key is... You can actually do this. Yeah, you can go... Like, one block. Um... Something annoying, though. When you're on grass path, boats can't go on grass and stuff like that until you, like, pull them up. Because they think grass path is shorter than dirt. Which it is, but only by one particle. I mean, pixels. So why would it matter? I don't know, but to Minecraft, it does. Oh, I went down too much. Okay, I'm going to have to abandon this boat. This is a lot harder than I thought. Might just use some dirt to make my way across this. And you know what? While I mine through here, then I'll be collecting dirt on the way as well. So it'll be just fine. And I'm about to dig through this farm. Or whatever this is. Yep, just a bunch of fences. Oh, and that's good, because that means I'll have blocks already placed for me. Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay, how am I going to do this? There we go. Hey, I did not know you could make pink dye out of pink petals. I mean, yeah, I guess it makes sense, because, you know, they're pink and stuff. You know what, we can go up from this. Oh, shipwreck. Okay, is there... Whoa! I almost went above that. Okay, is there a blacksmith anywhere? I like how this is a cherry grove. Right, you know what, I'm going to do something risky, I think. There we go. Didn't even need that extra block I placed. Just going to check for blacksmiths. I was really hoping there would be one. That's kind of unfortunate. Okay, I think we can boat the rest of the way down. Because I want to get to that golem, actually. Oh, how on earth are we going to do the golem? I have absolutely no idea. Uh, I guess I'll figure something out. Okay, I'm bringing this pig. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to make that dirt so that I don't accidentally go onto the grass path. I don't think this pig has ever been in a boat his entire life. It must feel so weird for him. Oh, great, I did do the block place. All right, why can't I fit through here? There's a perfect amount of space. Oh, come on. Right, come on. There's pixels to spare. Look at that. Why? Why can't I fit through this? Hold on a second. If I just break that one fence... Oh, I still can't get through. Oh, I understand why. It's because of these ones. There we go. And if I just do that again... Yeah. Hold on a second. The golem is actually very close. If I could just trap him somehow... Then I could get some iron. I don't know what use it has, but 
it would be a nice accomplishment. Yeah, weird accomplishment though. Killing a golem while in a boat. Oh no, I stepped on the grass path. Oh my days. Right. The golem is moving away. Stop moving so fast! What are you doing? Oh, I've kind of put... Oh, oh it's moving closer! Okay, I guess I've got it trapped. Oh, it's walking away. What if I just make a hole here? And then I just hope the golem walks in there. We could do that. Probably not going to happen, though. Oh. Oh. Come closer, please. Okay, you know what? There's probably no point in doing this at all. So I am going to stop. Oh, well, maybe another day. Okay, I've got to get out of this boat. Oh, hold on. Oh, ah, ah! No! I accidentally hit it. I was trying to trap it. I'm just going to quickly go over to where I died. Ah. Oh. Sorry, it keeps trying to lag every time I'm trying to speak. Um, the pig despawned, which was unfortunate. Um, hold on. It will be here. Aha, there we go. I think I'm going to abandon that boat. Where's the shipwreck? Okay, it's over there. You know what? I'm just going to try and make it to the shipwreck and loot it. That's my goal. Yep. My goal is to loot the shipwreck. Hopefully, it has a treasure chest. Now then, I haven't actually got hungry at all. So I think it's good that we did this. Whee! Isn't that cool? The boat went kind of underwater as well. That is an ocean monument. That would be very hard to loot. Oh, that was easy. Oh. What's better? Definitely protection. Moss blocks! I did all that for moss blocks! Yay! Well, I mean, is there another chest? I don't think so, unfortunately. I think that's it. I can't even eat the suspicious stew because I'm not hungry. Oh, oh wait a second. There's another chest. Treasure map. All right, we've got to find the treasure map. Come on. Sorry, I keep sniffing. I have a bad, bad cold. Okay. Let's go. X marks the spot. That's what they say. I prefer to put it in my off hand. Now then, the map hasn't rendered in yet, so I don't know how close or far away it is. I'm just going to hope that it's quite close. 
because it could be right about here or right over there. Ah, oh, is it gonna render in yet? Okay, well it should render in soon because look, we're coming up to a sort of dead end. Oh, we're moving closer. Aha, it's finally rendering. I saw this YouTube video on like tips for finding buried treasure on bedrock edition. Like when you look at the map and it's at a certain pixel, you always find the chest. But I forgot what it was. I mean, to be fair, I've never done it ever. All right, let's. You know what? Let's go to sleep. Oh yeah, you can't sleep underwater in this edition for some reason. Let me make a little contraption. Actually, I'm just going to do it over here. Oh, never mind. I'm not doing it over there. I'm going to... Ooh, witch. Ah, oh, this is a bit annoying. Okay, you know what? Let me just hope I can get back in the boat. Oh. Oh, dear. I'm flying away into the sky. You know what, my only goal now is to loot the buried treasure chest. Can you die already? Oh dear. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, I've got to make another boat. Wait, is it even going to throw potions at me? I don't think so. Uh, you've got to die anyways. I want to see what you drop. Oh, don't make a button, that would be stupid. Okay, I'm gonna go face the other way so that when I get in, I can just hit you straight away. <laughs> ah, you did my pushes! Okay, right, we've got to kill you. Oh, I did all that with the spider eyes. Garbage. Okay, come on, let's get this over with. Actually, I'm pretty sure it's somewhere in this stone. Ah, right. Okay, you know what? I can't do this anymore. I'm riding the horse. This is so painful! Ah, second try. There we go, this guy is gonna get me through a lot. Oh! It's here! Really? Here? No way! Wait a second, wait a second. Alright, I'm pretty sure it was that. Right there. Hold on, hold on. Wait, was it not one pixel hanging out? I think it was one pixel hanging out. Okay, 455 minus 120. Oh, you are a terrible jumper. Let me just build a little... Thing around. Okay, four, five, five minus one twenty. Okay then. Should be here, around here. Well, at least that's what my calculations say. 
Okay, I will need to go a bit lower. Actually, quite a lot lower. Yeah, let me just get my horse into there. Aha, uh -huh, perfect. Okay, if you could just move out the way, thank you. It's not under this coal, is it? Or was it a bit further along? Maybe it was. Alright, you know what? I'm going to set a two minute timer. And if I can't find it within that two minutes, I'll just go into spectator. Okay, there we go. I set it on my phone. No, because I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be over here somewhere. Why is the map black? Oh, wait a second. I'm hungry. What? Oh, come on. More poison. I already had poison. All right, you know, this is kind of unfair because I'm not mining. So let me just pause the timer for now. Okay, quickly, quickly, quickly. There we go, there we go. Let me just dig myself a little area to go in over here. Because I'm pretty sure it's not going to be this far down. So I'll just go down here. And I'll need to eat some apples to regenerate my health, won't I? Okay, let me start the timer now. Now, let's go searching. I am actually going to go in third person because I believe that will be easier to see. Oh, wow, this isn't going very well. Um, I can't even see the map. Okay, I think it's just better if we... No, 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 no. No! No! Oh, this is so rigged! Right. Game mode survival. Now let's do it. Now we are in a great position. I'm pretty sure it's somewhere along this line. Just, I don't know the exact coordinates. I wish I did. <gasps> Found it! Okay, it wasn't along that line I said it was, but it was very close. Okay, there we go. One diamond, nice. Uh, seven pieces of chainmail armor. Not very nice. But, I've got full armor now, because I had the helmet from before. People forget that you can find chain armor in the buried treasures. S some people think you can only get them from zombies or skeletons rarely wearing them, but nope. This too. Yeah, alright. Now that I've successfully completed my goal after a few slash gamer creatives, I um, am going to end the video. And this is how it looks like when my challenge ends. You just float up into the sky. Now then, I have never ever seen a buried treasure chest about 50 blocks away from the nearest ocean. That is weird. If someone in the comments knows why this happened, please tell me. Probably not, but, but we'll see. And don't forget to leave a like on this video if you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. And I'll see you guys in the next challenge video. But first, before I end it, I'm just gonna, um, die for no reason. Okay, see you later.